Okay, after opening up the wing, the covering, pulling back the sheeting, everything looks good, but you can see that the, uh, the whole bracket is loose. That's why it came loose. Let me pause it here. Okay, I had to tape back the covering. I mean, structurally, it looks like they did put enough um, uh, structure in here. Looks like we got ply double with the carbon ply stuff, but they didn't glue it in very good. See, that's the problem. Uh, I don't see hardly any glue anywhere. I don't can't feel it on the inside. This should be heavily epoxied and maybe fiberglass reinforced. You can see where the plywood here is delaminating right there where it's coming apart. So they put several layers of ply, but no glue or epoxy. Or fiberglass cloth would have been good. So I'll see it in first and then I'll put some epoxy on either side. They've got a lot to tie it to and they tied it to nothing. There's a there's no glue joint. There's a there's a rib under here that this butts against too and there's no glue in it at all. Looks like they just try to put a drop of glue in these tabs here. And is that rubberized glue so it came loose. So what happened is it torqued and it's moved side to side too. See that? So it crunched the uh the cover the thing. This isn't really hard flying. Airplane has a 150 in it versus a 120. I don't think the extra weight really had a clue. I think this is just going to be a might probably be a common thing. Um, this needed to be glued in a lot better. Um, they needed to take advantage of all the structure they got around it. Uh, all these tab glue joints and actually put some epoxy bead around it um, and just capture it better with uh, with glue. Um, so. I'll get it back together. Um, like I said, I'm going to CA it, and then I'm going to back it with, with the epoxy. I'll put a bead inside of here. Then I'll put a bead here. Then I'll put a bead on this side. I'll just wick the CA on this side. I don't feel like cutting the covering off here. It looks like that's a carbon fiber spar. Right? At least it ties in. It ties into the spar, and it looks like it touches the tube. So that's good. Good planning, just poor execution.